Brooklyn Church Food Pantry is on the brink of closing. Now with thousands relying on their help to put food on the table, church leaders are running out of time to keep the doors open. CBS 2's Naveen Dhaliwal has the story from Brownsville. For many, the Faith Forward Church Food Pantry is a lifeline, especially for Jennifer Barranco. I get to feed my kids, my grandkids. For 35 years, it's been a staple in Brownsville. Financially, spiritually, mentally, yes, it means a lot. Pastor Vivian Grubb sees the long lines every Saturday morning. We've seen our numbers grow exponentially over the last few years. Uh, we currently provide food for 400 families every week and that represents about 1600 individuals. But just two weeks ago, Pastor Grubb got this letter in the mail. A foreclosure sale that was going to take place on the 26th of October. For this property. For this property that we owned and we had no idea that this was coming. Stating the church property was going into foreclosure due to a lien on the property because of the previous owner. My mouth dropped to the floor. It looked like when we closed on the building, it was taken care of, but it, it came back. Somehow it, they, a lien was put against the property that we weren't, you know, we weren't cognizant of. Pastor Grubb says a judge has put a hold on the sale of the property, but has yet to decide what's next. Continue with foreclosure or let the previous owner hash it out with the banks. At least we've got a reprieve to stop the sale. And we're really looking forward to going ahead to see how do we get the church out of the equation and let it be between between the bank and the previous owner. As they wait for the courts to come to a decision, there's worry here. Prices of food is sky high right now. I'm on SSI. It's heartbreaking. What would we do? You don't have the funds to buy groceries. Groceries is expensive. But for Pastor Grubb, whose true mission is to provide for those in need. People look forward to us being here. The power of prayer and love for his community is stronger than ever. This is a place where people get a whole lot more than food, but food is the thing that brings us together. In Brownsville, Naveen Dhaliwal, CBS 2 News.